can't stop the show, so get fucking up. So let me break, break, break it all down for you. I ain't never giving up, I ain't never giving up. You know I'm gonna take, take, taking that crown from you. A little bit of the bubbly. What's going on you guys, it's the FPL Penguin, back again with another video for you all. In today's video, I'll be showing you how I got on in Game Week 2 of the UEFA Champions League Fantasy Game. And I also will be showing you my Game Week 3 team. Thanks guys, enjoy the video, hit the like button, hit subscribe, road to 800 subscribers guys. Cheers guys, drink the bubbly, let's do this. So this is how I got on in Game Week 2. 54 points. Well, it's better than game week one. My original captain at the start was Lewandowski. And I changed it for the second night to Mbappe. I did some substitutions as well. What on Barrios? RB Leipzig lost 5-0 to Manchester United. Now that was a real headache to watch. For a second time in a row in the UEFA Champions League. No goals for Lewin. No goalski. Bloody hell. Absolutely crazy that. He's rocking it in Bundesliga, but in the UEFA Champions League, he's quiet. But I'm going to still keep my team for the rest of the group stage and for the whole competition because he's that good of a player. And when he turns up, he turns up. So that's my midfield. Salah got a late goal. It was a late penalty, which was great to see. He started on the bench, was gutted about, but he came on and got a very, very late penalty, scored one, and it was absolutely great to see that. So I got the points for that. And defence, just pretty average. Akimi. Uh, finishing 0-0 against Shakhtar so I was uh, overall I'm, I'm all right I'm pretty happy with it I'm around about 436k baby steps like in the FPL team if you do follow my uh, FPL adventures so that's how we got on in game week two now moving on to game week three my team selection I've done my two free transfers and I bought in uh, De Jong and I've also brought in Kimmich as well I like this team a lot so what the plan is with Captain C now I'm getting used to this, how this game works. I'm captain Lewandowski for the first night. And then on the second night, Mbappe plays. So if he doesn't do anything again for a third time in a row, I'll be very, very surprised. I will then captain Mbappe. Because they're playing like a 4-4-2 at the minute PSG with him and Keane up front. And he got two assists with Keane getting two goals last night. So that's my little plan with Captain C. I needed a Barcelona player in there. They're playing uh, Dynamo. Is it what the name is? Is it Dynamo Kiev? I have no idea. And I'd love Messi in my team. Can't fit him in. I prefer that front three. So I'll put in there De Jong in that stead. And he's cheaper than Fatty too. And Fatty looks like he's a bit of rotation at the minute with Dembele back as well. So once again, I'm hoping I can better my previous game week. And hopefully get around 65 to 70 plus points. Something like that. I did forget to mention from a Game Week 2 review, I was annoyed when Koundé did play and start and got a clean sheet against Reigns last night. The app said he was still injured and I was really annoyed about that. So he's on my bench. I think he's playing on the second night. So I'll probably play him. Thanks guys for watching. Let me know how you got on this game week and who your captain will be for the next game week and where you are in the overall table. Thanks guys. Subscribe, hit like, join the bubbly bunch and see you later. I'ma take this day, turn it to my day. Oh, oh, she love me, sipping bubbly.